Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new. Thank you so much for being here and clicking on today's video. Today we are continuing on with our fall cleaning and decorating. Today I'm in my living room, family room area and I'm super excited to share it with you guys. Before we go any further, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already so you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. I have a lot of fun videos for the coming holiday season that I'm really excited to share with you guys. So don't forget to really quick hit that subscribe button and let's hop into it. Stocking more in conversations with you. With you. I'm gonna leave. I'm starting here on my shelves. I have built in shelves on either side of this doorway. These are a little tricky for me because they're not the same on both sides, especially this side here that I'm working on. All of the shelves are different heights and sizes, and so it's hard for me to get them to feel symmetrical without having the same thing on both sides. So it takes me a minute to get through here. They also are very, very dirty, and so I'm dusting and kind of decorating and cleaning as I go. Um, and in the end, I will zoom out and show you kind of a full picture of what I do. But I'm really focusing on just like those key things that can help make my space cozy without having to over decorate. I don't want to put it on a lot of things that are fall specific and get sick of them or feel like it's too cluttered. So I'm switching out things like my florals so they're not so summery and a little bit more cozy and warm and more appropriate for fall adding a couple pumpkins in here and there but keeping a lot of my decorations the same so that i don't feel kind of cluttered and crowded i'm on my way now You'll notice that I have a lot of pictures, family pictures that I use in my decor, especially on my shelves. I like to fill my home with the people that live in it and the people that I love and are important to me. This isn't necessarily for everybody. Not everybody likes to use pictures of their family in their decor, um, but I do, especially here in the family room. We spend a lot of time here, so it's nice to be able to look at the people that we love and that are important to us rather than just a bunch of things that I've bought at Hobby Lobby or Target or Walmart or wherever. So like I said, it's not for everyone, um, but it does help fill the, the shelf space and it's important to me. These people are important to me, so I like it. I wanted a kind of a big statement piece for my mantle. I didn't have anything in my decor already that I was loving and I didn't want to go and buy something new. Um, but I did have a lot of florals that I wasn't using this year that I didn't really have a space for. And so I decided to put them all together into sort of a swag that I could put on my mantle that's unique to me. And I'm still getting use out of all of these other decorations that I wasn't going to use otherwise. So this is a good fun thing to do if you have some extra florals laying around. I just wired it all together with some thin floral wire and then I covered the middle with a piece of ribbon. Um, you could put this on a staircase or on a mantle like I did or above a door it would be really beautiful. But this is just a fun idea if you have some extra florals laying around and it will be unique to you. Nobody else will have it.
I have this idea for my mantle with um, kind of like a bunch of asymmetrical pumpkins piled up on this one side with this stool. Um, we have two pumpkin patches near us opening up this Saturday, so I will go and get a bunch of real pumpkins to do this with, but I wanted to kind of get a feel for it. So for the time being, I'm using these faux pumpkins that I had left over uh, just to kind of get a feel for it and see if I like it. But on Saturday, I'm really excited to go and get some real pumpkins and switch them out so I can have this big, beautiful pumpkin masterpiece that I can share with you guys. Nobody loves me better. Nobody loves me better. Right now I'm standing in the corner I see you from across the room It's kind of crowded here But I know you see me too Everybody's singing oh Everybody's singing oh I don't know what it is about you It must be in the way you move Just say you want me to We got nothing to lose You're looking so old Baby, let me love you. Here is a look at the room all put together with all of my fall decorations out. If you guys missed my last video, it was a fall decorate with me in the kitchen area. I will link that in the description below so you guys can check that out for some more fall decorating inspiration. I'm really excited for Halloween. I have a lot of fun ideas to share with you guys. So if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of those videos. I would love to chat with you guys in the comments. Let me know what your thoughts are or if you try to make a swag of your own or if any of this inspired you, I would love to hear about it and see pictures of it and just chat with you guys. So like I said, if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, leave a comment if you want to, and I hope to see you in my next one. I don't know how, but it feels like